Cheers guys and welcome to this premiere, the first showcase of Fably AI's watch party. We dive into the story of Sabrina versus the Guardian of Light, which is a co-creation of GPT-40, Leonardo AI and hold on, also a human for interactive input. So we're still in there. So kick back and enjoy Sabrina and her funny gelatinous pet wobbler. Yeah, she has one of those. And once in a while, I'll quickly pause and explain what's going on in case it's too quick. So let's go and enjoy. Sabrina, a human mage, strolled through the bustling enchanted market. Her quirky pet wobbled the gelatinous cube bouncing beside her. The sun cast a golden glow, making the stalls shimmer with magic. Exotic aromas of spices and potions filled the air, mixing with the lively chatter of traders and adventurers. Awesome. I love this picture. Sorry for interrupting so quickly because I just wanted to point out that I guess the AI mistook uh, Wobbler, her gelatinous pet, with those colorful lampions in the air, which is fine. It's still an amazing image and it looks great, but it's just uh, something to point out. And also the elixirs here I wanted to talk about, they look so strange and those fruits, I've never seen anything like it. And this is us in case you didn't notice. We're just checking out this equipment store here on the side with Wobbler on our side, bouncing up and down, having fun and enjoying the time of his life. Tents lined the cobblestone streets, each boasting unique wares from enchanted trinkets to spellbound tomes. At a nearby stall, a gnome with wild white hair and a monocle waved at Sabrina. Ah, Sabrina, good to see you, he exclaimed. This was Gizmo, an eccentric inventor with a penchant for peculiar gadgets. Hello, Gizmo. What new wonders have you concocted today, Sabrina asked, her eyes gleaming with curiosity. Gizmo grinned and unveiled a small shimmering orb. This, my dear, is the orb of whimsy. It does a... Well, I'm not quite sure yet, but it's definitely whimsical. Wobble gurgled in amusement, its gelatinous form quivering with excitement. <laughs> Uh, that's that was so funny. I just wanted to tell you that I love the sense of humor this AI gave this story. It's a whimsical orb, certainly. <laughs> and not even this this gnome knows what his orbs do. Orb of whimsy to wobble. Here to you wobble. go, wobble. Let's see what it does. Wobble eagerly absorbed the orb into its gelatinous body. Almost instantly, vibrant colors swirled within its form and it began to jiggle and bounce energetically. Magical sparks flew from Wobble as it transformed into different whimsical shapes. A star, a bunny, and even a tiny dragon. Gizmo clapped his hands in delight. Well, it appears the orb of whimsy has a rather amusing effect on gelatinous cubes. Fascinating! As Wobble continued its playful antics, the crowd around them began to laugh and cheer, thoroughly entertained by the spectacle. Sabrina couldn't help but smile at the joy her peculiar pet was spreading. Suddenly, the orb began to glow brighter and Wobble started to float off the ground, spinning uh -oh. faster and faster. Sabrina's eyes widened in surprise. Uh oh, uh -oh. Gizmo muttered. Perhaps we should intervene before Wobble floats away. Sabrina quickly conjured a containment spell, her fingers tracing intricate patterns. So she's now drawing those patterns because she's a mage and trying to contain him. And I hope that it works. It looks like this gelatinous pet is now secure in her hands. Sabrina quickly conjured a containment spell, her fingers tracing intricate patterns in the air. Stay grounded, Wobble, she commanded. The spell took effect, creating a shimmering barrier around Wobble, gently bringing him back to the cobblestone street. With a deft motion, Sabrina extracted the orb of whimsy from Wobble's gelatinous form. Gizmo sighed in relief. Good show, Sabrina. That could have gotten out of hand. Sabrina handed the orb back to Gizmo, who carefully placed it in a padded box. So, Gizmo, she began, are there any quests or adventures you know of? Gizmo's eyes twinkled with excitement. Ah, yes, there's a rumor of a hidden vault beneath the Whispering Woods, said to contain ancient relics and powerful artifacts. But beware, it's guarded by an enigmatic creature known as the Luminescent Guardian. Wobble gurgled, seemingly excited by the prospect of a new adventure. Sabrina raised an eyebrow. What can you tell me about this Luminescent Guardian, Gizmo? Gizmo adjusted his goggles, leaning in conspiratorially. The Luminescent Guardian is a spectral being of immense power. It's said to glow with a radiant light that can blind and disorient foes. Its weakness lies in darkness. Shadows can nullify oh, its brilliance. Makes sense. Sabrina nodded thoughtfully, considering the implications. Thank you, Gizmo. I think it's time we gather some supplies. 
With Wobble squelching along beside her, Sabrina explored the bustling stalls of the enchanted market. She found a vendor selling shadow-infused cloaks perfect for countering the Guardian's light. Another stall offered potions that granted temporary night vision, ensuring she could see even in pitch darkness. After making her purchases and feeling more prepared, Sabrina felt a surge of anticipation for the journey ahead. The path to the Whispering Woods was winding and dense with foliage, but Sabrina's determination was unwavering. As they approached the forest's edge, the air grew cool and thick with the scent of pine and moss. The Whispering Woods were aptly named. The trees seemed to murmur secrets as the wind rustled through their leaves. Sabrina felt a shiver of anticipation. Stay close, Wobble, she whispered. The gelatinous cube followed obediently, so its surface funny. shimmering in the faint light. After a short trek, an ancient stone archway emerged from the shadows, marking the entrance to the hidden vault. A soft, eerie glow emanated from within, hinting at the presence of the luminescent guardian. Sabrina adjusted her cloak, readying herself for the confrontation ahead. Donning the shadow-infused cloak, Sabrina melded into the darkness, her form becoming nearly invisible. She signaled Wobble to follow her lead and began to quietly navigate through the dense underbrush towards the glowing light of the Guardian. As they neared the heart of the vault, the luminescent Guardian's radiant form came into view. The creature floated gracefully, its light casting eerie, dancing shadows on the stone walls. Uh -oh. Sabrina held her breath, every step taken with the utmost caution. Suddenly, a twig snapped underfoot. As they neared the heart of the vault, the luminescent guardian's radiant form came into view. The creature floated gracefully, its light casting eerie, dancing shadows on the stone walls. Sabrina held her breath, every step taken with the utmost caution. Suddenly, a twig snapped underfoot. The guardian's luminescence flared, scanning the area with intense beams of light. Sabrina froze, her heart pounding in her chest, but the cloak held its magical properties, cloaking her presence in shadows. <laughs> After what felt like an eternity, the Guardian resumed its patrol, allowing Sabrina and Wobble to continue deeper into the uh. vault. Reaching a massive, ornate door covered in ancient runes, Sabrina knew she had reached her destination. Examining the intricate runes etched into the massive door, she muttered arcane phrases, her fingers tracing the patterns as her mind worked to decipher their meaning. Asterisk, asterisk, arcana check roll. The, what? 1D 20 plus 5. Oh, no. Oh no, okay. Sabrina stepped forward, examining the intricate runes etched into the massive door. She muttered arcane phrases, her fingers tracing the patterns as her mind worked to decipher their meaning. Asterisk, asterisk, arcana check roll. 1D 20 plus 5. Equal sign 18 asterisk, asterisk. The runes began to glow faintly as Sabrina's magical knowledge unlocked their secrets. These runes, they speak of a trial of wisdom and courage, she murmured. The door shifted slightly, hinting at its acceptance of her understanding. Wobble oh. gurgled in excitement as the door creaked open, revealing a dimly lit chamber filled with relics and treasures. At its center stood a pedestal with an ancient artifact, a golden amulet with a radiant gem at its heart. As Sabrina stepped inside, the guardian's light intensified at the threshold, but still did not breach the chamber. Hash, hash, hash. No. <laughs> The amulet's guardian, Sabrina, invoked a protective spell, her words weaving a shimmering barrier around her. She felt the arcane energy pulse through her, bolstering her resolve. Wobble wobbled beside her, watching curiously as she approached the pedestal. Asterisk, asterisk, asterisk. spell components, verbal, <laughs> somatic asterisk, asterisk. With each step, the amulet's gem seemed to pulse in response to her presence. As she reached out, the protective barrier crackled against a sudden surge of magical energy from the amulet. The charm, bound to ancient enchantments, seemed to resist her touch. Sabrina no. focused, her protective spell holding strong as she finally grasped the amulet. Yes. The chamber rumbled, a deep, resonant sound echoing through the stone. The luminescent guardian hovered at the entrance, its light fluctuating as if sensing the disturbance. Asterisk, asterisk, amulet name. The amulet of brilliance, asterisk, asterisk. Sabrina secured the amulet in her satchel, its weight a reassuring presence. The guardian remained at bay, unable to penetrate the shadows Sabrina and Wobble cloaked themselves in. Lucky Sabrina for quietly us. whispered to Wobble, let's get out of here. She uncorked one of the night vision potions and both drank it down quickly. 
the world shifted to hues of gray and black, enhancing their stealth. With their protective spell still active and the shadow-infused cloak enveloping her, Sabrina moves silently towards the exit. Stealth check roll. 1d20 oh. plus 3 equals sign 21. Each step was meticulously placed, avoiding any debris that might betray their position. Wobble, mimicking her caution, followed closely. The Guardian's luminescent form drifted nearby, its light searching the area with an otherworldly vigilance. Oof. Sabrina held her breath, every muscle tensed as they inched closer to freedom. Finally, they reached the ancient stone archway without alerting the Guardian. The cool outside air met them, bringing a sense of relief. Sabrina gave Wobble a thumbs up, and they moved swiftly away from the vault, the amulet secure in her satchel. Satisfied, Sabrina considered their next move and Wobble found a secluded spot beneath a large oak tree, its ancient branches offering shelter. Sabrina withdrew the asterisk asterisk amulet of brilliance asterisk asterisk from her satchel, its radiant gem glowing softly. She began to chant an arcane incantation, her fingers tracing mystical symbols in the air around the amulet. Asterisk asterisk arcana. Check roll, 1DD 20 plus 5 equals sign 23 asterisk asterisk. It's so good. The gem flared 23. Brightly revealing a hidden script along the amulet's edge. Seriously. Sabrina deciphered the ancient runes, her eyes widening as she uncovered the artifact's true potential. The amulet could channel powerful bursts of radiant energy, provide protection against dark magic, and enhance the wielder's wisdom and courage. Bull gurgled approvingly as Sabrina placed the amulet around her neck. The she amulet. felt a surge of power, the amulet's properties harmonizing with her own magical abilities. Sabrina decided to seek out a powerful wizard. She recalled an old mentor, Eldrin the Wise, who resided in a grand tower near the town of Moonshade. Eldrin was known for his vast knowledge of ancient artifacts and mystical lore. The journey to Moonshade took several hours with the twilight sky casting a serene glow over the landscape. What an amazing image. The twilight sky, the moon castle. Well, it looks... It looks perfect. As Sabrina and Wobble approached ahead, Eldrin's the tower, they were greeted by the soft hum of magical wards protecting the entrance. A gentle knock on the massive oak door caused it to swing open, revealing Eldrin's welcoming figure. Eldrin, a tall elf with silver hair and piercing green eyes, greeted them warmly. Ah, Sabrina, it has been too long. What brings you to my humble abode? Sabrina explained her recent adventure and presented the Amulet of Brilliance to Eldrin. His eyes widened as he examined the artifact, nodding thoughtfully. This amulet is indeed a rare find. It once belonged to a legendary hero, its powers unmatched. <laughs> Eldrin offered to delve deeper into the amulet's history and uncover its full potential. Okay, that is it. And this was episode one. And I asked him to do episode two for the next time. I hope you stay tuned for that and you enjoy it. And see you all in the next video. Bye bye.